two years since a Milwaukee man was killed the day after Christmas. His killer now still on the loose tonight. The victim's family came together to send a message that justice will be served. Sean Gallagher spoke to them tonight during a vigil held in his memory. Sean. It was an emotional night near 39th in Michigan, where 27-year-old DeAndre Allen was killed two years ago. Now, there hasn't been an arrest yet, but that won't stop his family from continuing to seek justice. Justice will be served! It's a seasonably warm night in Milwaukee, but it doesn't compare to the fire burning inside Shannon Allen, determined to find the person who killed her oldest son, DeAndre. And if you're watching, turn yourself, turn yourself in. This has been two years and it's nothing but pain and heartache. Turn yourself in. Five of DeAndre Allen's six children were at the day after Christmas vigil, including four-year-old Armani, who spent just as much time without his dad as he did with him. Somebody just killed my daddy. I will feel great because his kids can have closure. My mama can have closure. Look at these babies' face. This is his youngest son. Look at the tears rolling down his eyes. Look at his oldest children. Look at his youngest child. This is the reason why I keep fighting so hard. Her fight isn't just for her son. She wants to make sure no one feels the pain her family has. This year alone, the homicide rate has gone down dramatically. Earlier this month, Milwaukee police said there were 96 murders this year, down from 119 last year. It makes me feel good to know that the homicide rate is going down. But we can do a lot more better. You know, the crime needs to come to a halt. And Shannon Allen says that she checks with police on the 26th of every month for updates on the murder. She says today police told her they know who they're looking for and they know where they're going with the case. So it's only a matter of time. Tom. All right, Sean, thanks.